And now taking a look at some news in order to protect you, Consumer Affairs is reporting that the missed court date scam is making rounds across the country again, and that includes North Carolina. According to Consumer Affairs, the Broward County Sheriff's Office in Florida says that it's received reports in the last week that scammers called victims using a spoofed phone number and told them that they missed a court date. Then, get this, they tell the intended victim that they need to send money through an online application, and that's to avoid a warrant for their arrest. Well, the same scam has recently appeared in Brunswick County, North Carolina, which is on the coast along the South Carolina border. In the North Carolina cases, the scammer uses a, uses a fake officer's name, that name, Sergeant George West, and then he tells his intended victim that they missed a court date and they're in a lot of trouble. Now, victims were then told to go purchase gift cards, now one of the favorite ways that scammers try to receive money. Needless to say, courts do not accept gift cards as payments. In Summit County, Ohio, scammers are calling residents there at random, telling them that they face arrest because they didn't show up for jury duty. Now, after intimidating their intended target and trying to scare them, the scammers then say that paying a fine will make the entire matter go away. But in the real world, it doesn't work that way. Administrative Judge Catherine Michael is quoted as saying that citizens need to be aware of all of these types of scams and should notify local law enforcement immediately. She said the community needs to be reminded that no one should provide any personal or financial information over the phone if they're targeted. Consumer Affairs reminds you that legitimate law enforcement officers would never demand any type of payment to avoid arrest. Now, if you're contacted by anyone who tells you that you've missed a court date or you've missed jury duty, law enforcement officials recommend that you simply hang up the phone and not engage the caller. Then contact the law enforcement agency in question in order to report that call. 